Hey guys, Michael from E-Kids, and I don't have all the blocks this time, but I want to go ahead and read the story. So I'm sorry, it's already late in the day. I've been really doing terrible the last few days of getting the, getting these things done on time. But let's go ahead and read this. We have, uh, um, this is December 22nd, a midnight passage from God. So let's check it out. Story of Joseph. God's special promise to Mary was, don't be afraid, God is coming to stay. Mary, you will get pregnant today. That was good news for Mary, but it sure seemed like bad news for a man named Joseph because, well, Joseph was planning on being Mary's husband. But when Mary got pregnant, Joseph thought, she must not want to be with me. So Joseph decided he wouldn't marry her. After all, she was having a baby with some other guy. You see, Joseph wasn't there when the angel talked to Mary. He hadn't heard anything the angel had said. So one night, the angel decided to talk to Joseph himself. The angel waited until Joseph fell asleep. Then he waited some more. He wanted to make sure Joseph was really asleep. Then he waited just a little bit more. And finally, he decided Joseph was completely, absolutely, honestly, and truly 100% asleep. That's when the angel jumped into Joseph's dream, a completely, surpri completely surprising Joseph. Joseph's mind was suddenly filled with a dazzling light. Joseph could just make out a figure. It looked a bit like a person, but it was far too bright to be any person he knew. Then the figure spoke, Hello, Joseph. And Joseph realized it was far too loud to be any person he knew, too. That's when it hit him. This is an angel. Joseph had never seen an angel before. He buckled up for what he thought would be a nightmare. But the angel said, Joseph, don't be afraid. I know you're worried about Mary having a baby. You think she wants to be with someone else. You think she's done something wrong, but that's not it at all. She still wants to be your wife. And she hasn't done a single thing wrong. So marry her. Trust me, God is behind this. And remember, God is always working in ways we wouldn't expect. You'll want to have a front row seat to what God is about to do. The angel explained that God was doing something new. He wasn't just sending a baby. He was sending a baby king. He was sending Emmanuel, God with us. Just then, Joseph woke up. He looked around his room, rubbed the sleep from his eyes, and whispered to himself, Emmanuel. Just like the prophet said, God with us. Suddenly, his small, dark, lonely room felt different. Joseph felt like God himself was there with him. And in fact, God was with Joseph. Which is why, as Mary got closer and closer to having her baby, Joseph grew happier and happier. He knew that even when it was hard, even when he was confused, even when the other people were confused, God was with him. So Joseph and Mary got married, and they waited for their baby to arrive, and they prayed. For such a long time, God seemed far away, but now... He has heard what we hoped and we prayed. God is coming to earth to stay. All right. We're getting close, guys. Christmas is almost here. We're almost, we're almost on Christmas Day. So, um, I don't know. I'm excited. Are you guys excited? All right. Well, I love you guys, and I will see you tomorrow for now. Bye.